What's going on guys, it's Kurt Dude here and I'm back today with the Black Ops 3 DLC 3 trailer, well zombies portion of the trailer reaction. So yeah, let's just get right into it. It's, oh, it's been a long time since we've had any information about it. Here we go, hold on. Full screen this shit. Come on. Just make sure the audio is all good. Okay. Right. Okay. This city has oh, seen yeah, that's the screenshot. Sure it, the pain. <coughs> it has been witness to horrors. The zombies have got red eyes. What? Question the very concept of humanity. Oh my god, the mounted machine guns. It's like a really bulky zombie there. I'll probably go back names, and look at this up there. But I know it. Stalingrad, Stalingrad, city of blood. This what should do the job. Is that? Job of killing. We don't need any fire here, dragon. I do not feel cold. That dragon looks mad. It's only that zombie. What? Oh, that shield looks sick. The Shadow Claw! Alright, Dempsey. Once more for old time's sake. <gasps> yes! <laughs> I wanted to get through this trailer without pausing it. Oh my god. I thought they were going to show the wonder weapon in the box, but okay, okay. Get the season pass now. Four DLC packs, one great price. Oh my god. Alright, I'm going to cancel that. I'm going to try and go back. And why is this in my recommended? What the fuck? Um, it's right, been witness to horror. No, shh, shh. Take most no, I'll unmute it. So the zombies have got red eyes, okay. That's a mounted machine gun. And then there's like a guy over to the left that I think may be the boss zombie. Where, what else did I want to look at? Um, oh yeah, the statues as well actually. Um, it, oh, hold on, there's a fallen dragon there, I didn't see that. Uh, there's also the fallen robot, obviously. Um, yep, they're running. That isn't a zombie. That's a skeleton. So God knows why it's electrified. Um, I think that might be something to do with the uh, punchy glove thing that we saw, which looks a lot like the Ripper. So hold on, I'm going to try and get a look at this. Oh, he uses coagulant. So, Job of so he uses coagulant, has a haymaker, and then it sounds like he's spraying a pack of punched ME. Triarch? What? So obviously there's the dragon, I don't need to look at the dragon. Okay, apparently I'm going to look at the dragon anyway. Uh, these things, like, hold on, let me go back, get a better shot. What the fuck are these? Dude. I'm pretty sure this is like, what? I've heard something about it being like six years after the big battle of Stalingrad. So why on earth there's like robots from the future? Who knows? Uh, the shield, yep. Yeah, Argus on the wall right there. Trap. I, you all know what I'm leading up to. Where is it? Did it go? Go back. The PPSH. Oh. The PPSH. It's about time they bought the PPSH back. Oh my god. And then later on, um, what? There was the Shadow Claws, I think, around here. Something like that. Oh no, it was after that. Oh, hold on, hold on, actually. This thing on the dragon's back um, was a blueprint in Zetsubo no Shima. 
Not that I've played down that much, but I've still been keeping up with the lore and everything. So, that thing on the back is blueprinted in Zetsubo no Shima, and there's enough spaces for four people to get into it. So I think the dragon's going to be a huge part of the easter egg. And the fact that the dragons can attack the zombies... Hold on. Never mind, it was in an earlier part of the trailer. But the dragons can attack the zombies, so they may be really overpowered. Oh, here we go. There's one called Be Berserk, another one called Cryogen, another map called Empire, another map called Rumble. So, God knows. But this DLC looks amazing. The fact that they bought the PPSH back is better than anything else they could have done. They could have bought back a remake with like 10 remade maps. But if they didn't have the PPSH, it would not be worth it. So, all in all, I think it's a really good trailer. Can't wait for DLC 3. It's been a long time. Hold on, 7th for the 12th. 7th for the 12th. Oh, 12th for the July then. So, it's like two weeks away. Something like that. Yeah, two weeks away. <sighs> Bring it on. Can't fucking wait for it. Obviously, I'm going to be bringing content to you guys as soon as it comes out. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you aren't already. Be sure to like the video if you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in the next one. Also, guys, uh, as I was watching the trailer back, I also saw this could potentially be a Raygun Mark III. So, look forward to it.